This tutorial will demonstrate how to download and unzip the Alphabet 2 font from MyVinylDesigner.com. We are on the home page for MyVinylDesigner.com and I will show two different methods for searching for the Alphabet 2 font. The first option is to bring your mouse to the top of the screen to the words Specialty Collections. By just hovering your mouse over these words we can scroll down to AL Monograms for Alphabet Monograms. Single clicking on this link brings us to the Alphabet Monograms page. The alphabet we are interested in is Alphabet 2. It is the third image on the top row from the left. By single clicking on this image, it brings us to the Alphabet 2 font page. You will notice a box in front of the words Add to Cart. By selecting this box, we would add this alphabet to our cart. However, I'm not going to select this at this time because I would like to show a second search method for searching for the Alphabet 2 font. If we type in Alphabet 2 into the search field and select the word Go, a new page will appear showing the Alphabet 2 font. There's only one result, and so if we single click on this image, again, it'll bring us to the Alphabet 2 font page. This time, I am going to check the box in front of the words Add to Cart. You will notice a box, you will notice a check appear in the box. Also, in the upper right hand portion of the page, you will notice a red number one next to the word cart. To go ahead and check out, click on the link, which is the word cart, by single clicking, and your shopping cart page will appear, which shows that we have the Alphabet 2 font in our cart. At this time, we can enter any gift certificates or coupon codes that you have. I have a code, so I'm going to go ahead and enter it at this time. If you do not have a code, that is okay. That is okay. Just go ahead and single click on the word check out. From here, there are three options to proceed forward. You can check out without an account, create a new account, or log in with an account that you already have. If you have to create an account, select this option and fill in the appropriate information. If you already have an account, go ahead and type in your information which I have already done, and then I'm going to select Login. On this page is the checkout page. You will notice that my coupon code has been successfully applied. If your email address does not appear, go ahead and enter it at this time. Again, check that your order is correct and single click on the word Continue. This page is the checkout page, and my coupon code covered the cost of my order, so I do not have to pay anything. However, if you do not have a coupon code, this is the portion where you would enter in your payment information. Again, check that we are purchasing the Alphabet 2 font. And for the download type, the eCraft machine will import SVG file, which stands for Scalable, scalable Vector Graphics. So if we go ahead and click this option, and scroll down and we are going to place the order. However, there is an option for comments if you would like to place any there. But if not, go ahead and single click on the word place order. This brings us to the order receipt page. If we scroll down, we can check to make sure that SVG is shown here in this box because that is the format that we would like. Now the option here shows us that we want to download files in SVG format. We're going to right click on this link and then choose the option save link as. Now wherever you save this file write it down because we're going to have to pull it open again in a minute to unzip it. So make note where you're downloading it. I save everything in a file called vinyl for me and so we are going to go ahead and select save once you have it where you want to save it. And depending on the connection speed will depend on how long it takes the file to upload. Once the file has completed uploading, go ahead and find the file where you have it saved. Here's the compressed file. 
you know it's the one because it has a zipper on the folder. Right click on the file and select the words extract all. You can change the destination of where this file will save and be extracted by selecting this word browse. I usually just keep it to the default. And I'm also going to keep the box checked for show extracted files when completed. And then after we're done, single click the word extract. And the new page appears showing the word files. Double click on this file and another compressed file appears. You can again tell that it's a compressed file because it has a zipper on the folder. Again, right click on the file, select the words extract all. Again, I'm going to leave it to the default. However, if you'd like to change the destination file, you can do so by selecting the word browse. And I'm also going to leave the box checked for show extracted files when complete. And now I'm going to go ahead and single click on the word extract. And this is folder showing the entire alphabet that we have just downloaded and extracted, as well as a few support files. There should be 31 files that were extracted. And now that we now we are done, so we're going to go ahead and I'm just going to go ahead and close out all these files and go ahead and check out the next stage that shows how to import the SVG files into the eCraft Pro software.